Hi, my name is David Petrino. I am the Director of Innovation for the Department of Rehabilitation and Human Performance at Mount Sinai. Hi, I'm Chris Kellner. I'm a cerebrovascular neurosurgeon at Mount Sinai. Uh, Precision Recovery is a program that Chris and I developed together as, as a sort of interdepartmental collaboration. Uh, we initially made it to really focus on individuals who were recovering from stroke but needed close daily monitoring. Um, in the wake of the COVID-19 crisis, we rapidly adapted the program to provide day-by-day -day monitoring of individuals who were showing symptoms of COVID-19, who were worried about their health, but didn't have anything beyond a quick telehealth visit to um, give them ideas about whether they should be going to the emergency room or not. This program was developed for patients, anybody who has symptoms that could be suggestive of COVID-19, any respiratory symptoms, any fever, any headaches, and they want to have those symptoms tracked over time. Um, so our platform will track those symptoms and then contact the patient if there's uh, a, an alert that the symptoms show that the patient's worsening. Um, and in that case, then we can connect them directly with a provider. Uh, the reason that this platform is so innovative is because uh, for the most part, when you hear about telehealth, the, the main thing that happens is access to doctors via an urgent care scenario. Um, what we're really doing here is we're going beyond that model. We're making sure that skilled individuals are checking in on patients on a daily basis because that's what we really need to flatten the curve and decrease the, the burden on emergency departments. Um, and given that Chris and I have been working on remote patient monitoring for a, a number of years, this is really in our DNA. So we knew how to build it and roll it out rapidly. Um, however, in terms of getting this out to other hospitals, um, we really want as many people using this as possible. This is not a situation where we're trying to sort of corner a market here or anything like that. And as a result, on our website, we have de left detailed instructions for every hospital system in New York and beyond how to build their own version of this system. We're really just trying to get it out into the ecosystem and make it as accessible to everyone as possible because we're in the middle of a crisis and we want all of our patients to have access to this. The way that this works to keep people out of the emergency department is one of the things that we were noting in the current response um, to COVID-19 is that um, individuals will show up to an emergency department, they'll be told, you know, yeah, you're showing symptoms of COVID-19, plus or minus a test. Sometimes they get a test, sometimes there, there is no testing available. And at that point, they're told, you know what, you're not, you're not sick enough for us to admit you, so go home, and if you get worse, uh, call us up or come back to the emergency room. And that is the end of the continuity of care. Now that raises a lot of issues because some people will get sicker and they won't know, oh, do I go in? Do I not go in? Do I call a doctor? And so on, on the one hand, we have a lot of people ready to race right back to the emergency room where all that is going to happen is they're going to sit there, get more exposure, and then probably be turned away because they're still not sick enough to be admitted. And then on the other hand, we have a number of patients who are really, you know, toughing it out. And, and although they're getting much sicker and we're concerned about them, um, they're not set showing up to the emergency room because the doctor told, told them not to. So what we're doing here is by monitoring these people much more closely and using individuals who um, uh, ordin or ordinarily would not be treating right now, um, to make these decisions and make a decision of when to escalate to a, a medical doctor, it allows us to really decrease the burden on the emergency departments. And that is what is really going to make the difference here when, when the surge comes. For a patient to sign up, all they have to do is text the number that we provide with the words precision recovery. And we have somebody monitoring 24 seven to respond to that patient with a Zoom link. And then we can initiate a video call and onboard that patient immediately. Um, patients eligible for this are really any patient in the entire country um, who has symptoms and wants those symptoms monitored. And if the symptoms progress, then we can alert the appropriate ambulance and get them to the right hospital. Most insurances have agreed to cover remote patient monitoring. Um, if there are problems with insurance, uh, we can work that out with, uh, with the patient. What we really want people to know about this program is that um, we're, we're really, you should think of us as a safety net. We're, we're really here to hear any and all concerns that people have about their symptoms. 
We will be monitoring them. We know that the program works. We, we've based all of what we're doing on, on previously published work that we have done in our, in our labs. And we know that remote patient monitoring works. We know that if you watch symptoms more closely, you can manage them as they progress more easily and with better precision. So we just really want to put it out there that anyone who is concerned um, should get, get themselves to us and we'll take care of them. So if you want to be a part of the program, there are, there are two ways to be enrolled into the program. First is uh, one of your Mount Sinai physicians may actually refer you to the program directly, in which case we will receive communication from your physician and we will reach out to you and enroll you into the program. However, if you don't have a Mount Sinai physician and you're feeling symptoms and you're concerned, uh, we have a text hotline where all you need to do is text precision recovery to that number and one of our coordinators will reach out to you and arrange a Zoom call with one of our precision recovery pro providers. From there, we will be tracking symptoms every single day that relate to your body temperature, your general symptoms around shortness of breath, whether you have a cough, whether you're experiencing pain or anxiety, um, and we will track those symptoms every single day. If we start to see something that we don't like, if your symptoms are starting to get uh, starting to worsen in a way that indicates that something serious is going on, we will immediately escalate you to one of the medical doctors who are working with our team. If they determine this to be an emergency, they will stay on the line and assist you to organize emergency services for wherever you are anywhere in the country. Um, and that is really the way that we are managing this, this system right now. In addition to regular monitoring of, of symptoms through the app, for individuals that are in high risk categories, we are also providing them with uh, a device called a pulse oximeter. This is a device that measures your blood oxygen level and tells us how well your lungs are actually taking in oxygen and passing it onto your bloodstream. For individuals who are high risk, we want that information. For individuals that we do not think are high risk, uh, we won't pass on that technology just yet uh, because we don't need that information. Uh, we can mail this technology out to anybody who changes their risk category from low risk to high risk. We do recognize that a lot of people um, are not so comfortable with, with mobile technology. So uh, using apps can be you know, unfamiliar and, and, and fairly difficult for them. Um, we also provide an over the phone service. So it, all you need to do is text the number um, with your, your name and the words precision recovery and our people will reach out to you. If you cannot uh, work out how to operate the app, we will happily provide the same service over the phone and walk you through that process. Um, we don't want anybody to miss out on this crucial daily monitoring just because using an app is difficult for them. We will make sure that everybody gets seen. That number once again, in order to get enrolled into the Precision Recovery Program is 332-213-9130. That is a local New York number. All you need to do is text your name and precision recovery to this number and one of our people will reach out immediately to get in touch. Thank you so much for joining us and everyone stay safe.